I think I think every character we try to preserve their complexity as much as possible. Mm -hmm. So Oakland is this beautiful, vibrant, interesting, charismatic town. It's also a town that's eating itself alive right now. Um, and and a town where there's extre there's extreme tension between the locals and the influx of new folks that are coming in, right? And so the town is different to who, depending on who you ask. Mm -hmm. And we wanted to talk about that, right? We wanted to talk about Colin and his changing context. Like Colin is, Colin is an ex-con and a really nice guy, and mm -hmm. those two are not mutually exclusive. Um, he's also he also has been a violent guy and is no longer a violent person. And wanted to present that in its complexity, this idea that like you are not one thing or one thing forever, and that people are trying to evolve constantly. And what social pressures make that happen versus what internal pressures make that happen. The same thing with Miles. Miles has fought as a minority among minorities in Oakland his whole life. Claiming space is all he's ever had to do in his neighborhood. Um, and now his neighborhood is changing. There's an influx of people that look just like him that he feels nothing nothing in common with mm -hmm. and is mistaken for. So he's back in fight mode again, which he hasn't had to do since he was much younger. Him and Colin have walked hand in hand, essentially as siblings, since they were like five. You know, So they have so much more in common than they have uh, uh, apart, but their context is changing. Mm -hmm. The city around them, the conversation around them is changing. And I think we, we tried to make a film that made it really specific to their reality, but I think any time we have a polarized country, people's context start to change in the conversation, and we have to adapt to that context. Mm -hmm.